Hi, I'm Mick Fanning. As a professional surfer, I meet champions from many sports, but there's one who stands out, Wallaby star David Pocock. At 27, Dave is now one of the best rugby union players in the world, but it's what he does off the field that makes him a real hero to me. He stands up for what he believes in, and I think that's pretty gutsy. Tonight we travel with Dave back to Zimbabwe, the only home he knew until his family fled to Australia when he was 14. Dave is totally an Australian, but he says Africa is a part of his life, not just somewhere he visits. Let's carry on slowly. He connects back to the people he knows, the African people. He connects back to the nature he's so passionate about, the birds and the wildlife. I have lots of fond memories for me as a kid growing up in Zimbabwe. It's one of those things where you grow up in a place, um, you always have that connection to it. These are tense and dangerous times in Zimbabwe's rural hinterland. The campaign of intimidation on the farm shows little sign of easing. Leaving Zimbabwe and, and coming to Australia, pretty much everything about our lives changed. The kids saw too much. It affected them greatly. I think my coping mechanism was sport. That's what I, I threw myself into, I became obsessed about. Pocock is arguably the best in the world. Rugby isn't defining for Dave. It's, it's not what defines him as a person. What I've seen in, in his life so far is a desire for social justice. The African story, the Australian migrant, now the wallaby. His story has shaped the man. And I don't think you can understand him without knowing his story. Available now on iTunes.